morning everyone. I'm Robert O'Crook from the Digital Nomads Forum. So I'm coming to you live from Singapore. I'm just doing a visa run before heading back to Bali tomorrow. And I just finished doing a morning yoga practice here in a park across from the hostel I'm staying in. Got some weird looks from people walking by and they're just like, what is this guy doing? Here he goes, someone walking by. We've got some uh, Indian people in the background playing cricket. I don't really know much about cricket, but that's cool. And so this video is uh, all about what I've learned over the last few years when it comes to self-investment. So for me, when I was 18, I, I started learning how to build WordPress websites while I was living in my parents' basement, ironically. And eventually I went to school for two years to get a marketing diploma and then I got a job in, a, in an irrigation, like a sprinkler company doing like super crappy stuff and a little bit of the marketing side of things. Uh, eventually getting a job in a professional digital marketing firm and quitting that job, starting to travel, figuring out freelancing. And this whole period took me about like eight years almost nine years so between the time from I was 18 till I started traveling when I was 24 didn't really nail the freelancing stuff until I was like 25 and now I'm 27 it's been two more years so it's been really this nine-year journey to get to where I'm at and about a year and a half ago around Christmas time I was reflecting and I was reflecting on how long it has taken me actually to you know, be able to travel the world and work remotely on projects that I actually care about. It's taken a while, it's taken this eight, nine year period. And what I realized was uh, it doesn't need to take that long at all. Like when I reflected back on the key learnings from this whole journey, I realized it was such a, such a smaller period of time that is needed to kind of get the core principles that helped me live a basically a more meaningful and happy life. And so that's where I actually came up with the idea for the Mindful Nomads Retreat. Some of you might have seen this project that I'm running. It's basically a week long boot camp where half of it's focused on the nitty gritty practical side of landing remote work. So the business, the money side of things, which is important. This is what's giving you the foundation to be able to then focus on the other half of life, in my opinion, which is service, service to others and service to ourselves. So how can you explore that aspect of yourself? Well, for me, it's been through mindfulness practices like yoga and meditation. So the second half of the retreat is focused on these things, yoga, meditation, and trying out a plant-based diet. In combination, it's this like life-changing week where we focus on creating this foundation that supports us by earning money, working on projects that we actually care about, and then starting to take care of ourselves and learn how to be in service to other people. And so I guess the Mindful Nomads Retreat is basically this culmination of the most valuable things I learned in my eight year journey from starting to build websites alone, watching free YouTube videos, and then being, travel being able to travel the world and kind of have so much more freedom. And so the insight that I've learned uh, in the last two years, especially around self-investment has been that I've always had this limiting belief that you can just do everything for free. And it's mostly true. Like when it comes to YouTube videos and uh, the free content that you can find online, there is an abundance of amazing free, high quality content. But the challenge is in the abundance and in another realization I'm about to share. Like when there's so much content, it makes it so difficult to kind of just find a, a clear step-by-step -step roadmap on what you need to do to be successful and whatever your goals are. And that's what I need. Like I need like tangible step one, step two, step three. And the smaller those things can be broken down, amazing. Because the more uh, like accessible and possible in progress I can feel when I check off each one and make my make my progress. So the other huge important thing that I realized is that while there is an abundance of amazing free content, if you really want the best stuff, 
it's gonna come from people who are able to focus their time full time on creating that content for you. Like, if you're gonna get a heart surgery and are you gonna go find a doctor who's just working on the weekends, you know, casually, casually doing it? Or do you want someone who's doing that for like 40, 50 hours a week? And of course, when it comes to a heart surgery, we're gonna look for the expert. And this is the same approach I think we need to take with anything we want to get done or to learn, is to find the person who's fully committed to that thing full time, who really has experience, and get help from them. But here's the reality, is that they can only be fully committed to that thing if they're being financially supported, for the most part. Otherwise, how are they gonna do it all week long? They've gotta put food on the table, they need somewhere to sleep, this costs money in most places and in most communities, in most cultures. So by only looking for the free content, we're almost kind of excluding ourselves from connecting with the paid offerings that experts are creating for us so that they can actually live, they can eat, they can sleep somewhere comfortable and fully devote themselves to creating and sharing the best ways for us to do things. So I hope some of this resonates for you. Uh, my name is Robert O'Crook. Please join the Digital Nomads Forum Facebook group if you're not in it already. We've got 9,000 amazing, 9,000 plus amazing digital nomads from around the world supporting each other. And if you're feeling like you could use some support trying to figure out the world of remote work, especially meaningful remote work, and learning how to take care of yourself and be in service to others, then check out the Mindful Nomads Retreat. I'll include a link to it in the video description. Give me a like if you enjoyed this video, comment with any questions or comments. And if you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe if you'd like to get more content from me. Thanks for tuning in everyone. I'm Robert O'Crook. Ciao for now.